<laughs> you guys, it seems like we're always in the damn car when we're vlogging, but it's just we have so much like on our schedule daily. So before we get the video going, make sure you hit the like button. Don't be a hater, all you got life and hit the subscribe button, you bitch. Click the little bell that way you get notified every time I post a new video. And as promised today, as you can tell by the title of this video, we are collabing with Chingo Bling and his wife. Body swole. So y'all so y'all make sure y'all stay tuned for that. We are pulling up to H E B to get essential needs. Houston, take a shoe off. Say la boy. Y'all wanna know what happened this morning? Tell them, baby. Tell them what happened. What happened? Oh, my damn kids. I come outside and my car door is all the way open. This door. Mind you, it rained last night. It's raining. All night it rained. This door was wide open all night. Kids got out the car, didn't shut the door. And shut the garage, shut the garage down. But left the car door open all the way. So it was all wet up in there. Okay, let's go. My neighbors could have came and told me, hey, your car door's open. They want to come tell me when I'm being loud. They couldn't tell me my door was open. The birds. Oh, the birds. The birds. The bird, bird, bird. Oh. The bird is the bird. I said the bird, bird, bird. The bird is the word. <laughs> Yo, so. <laughs> Houston is such a character, you guys. Like, he legit grabs the comb, points at my gel, and like stands in front of me and tells me to do his hair. Lately, he's been doing that. And then today, he didn't grab my deodorant, and then he was like putting it under his shirt. Like, I'm trying to put on some deodorant. He wanted the broom broom. No, 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 no. Aw, that's a party pooper. Who's ready for New Year's 2020? Big 20. I want one of these, babe. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we need drinks. Go in here. White crayon peach. White crayon strawberry. Hold on, look, my creamer. Two for five, when you buy two. Is that a deal? I'm gonna just get one. Yeah, we made it up out of H-E-B. We're on our way home. Bert is at our house. You want to explain why? Okay, for those that y'all don't know, Big Bert, Big Bert, my homie, was on the same, we belong to the same record company. He worked for Dope House Records when I was signed to Dope House Records back in the day. He's still one of the original founders of Dope House Records. Anyway, he still works for me from time to time doing things. That flash drive that we made, he's the one who put all the music on there for me. People <laughs> have been emailing me back saying, yo, I got the album, I got the flash drive, I love it, that's all the music on there, except for one little problem. On the North 3 album, track two, is Baby Shark, do 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 Baby Shark. So I'm like, what? So I call Bert. I'm like, say, Bert, why is people talking about there's a Baby Shark song on North 3? They in the car riding, smoking, chilling, jamming off three. All of a sudden, Baby Shark come on the radio. And he's like, I don't know. Let me take a look. And then he looks and he says, oh, man. My daughter had that song on my desktop. And I must have dragged it accidentally when I was putting the files together. <laughs> so I got pa I got packages of all these flash drives pre-packaged, ready to go with that song on each flash drive. So now he's at my house right now waiting on me because now he has to go through every flash drive, remove that song, and put the correct song. We apologize for everybody that had already caught the... Um... Yeah, if you got your flash drive, and if you got a flash drive and your NOF 3 is wrong, leave your email and we will send you the correct NOF 3. But uh, other than that, everybody who ordered the shirt, 
that got the free flash drive, we're barely sending y'all's out tomorrow anyway. So y'all don't got to worry. Y'all good. Don't forget that the deal ends tomorrow. So if you buy a black blue channel TV, don't be a hater. Uh, you will get a free flash drive with it. With the so, correct music. Look at this. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. <laughs> look at this guy. We just told on you. It's his fault. It's his fault. <laughs> <laughs> he looks lost. <laughs> all right, you guys, we're about to get off, get all these groceries out, and get to it. We almost done. We got these. We got all those to go. We got three computers gone. Taking the Baby Shark song off. Thanks to Mr. Big Bird over here. How's yeah. breakfast? Oh, breakfast was actually real good. No carbs. No carbs. Get off of carbs. Houston. Hmm. H-Town. All right, so we're sitting here. We just got done. Oh, he's on the last one. And he was telling a story. He was, we were sitting here telling old school stories. And he was telling a, 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 a old story about the Power Moves album, SPM's Power Moves album. Those of y'all that don't know, it came with a double. It was a double album. It had the screwed and chopped version. Well, I think it was just screwed version. And then it was the regular version. But the screw version we had DJ Screw on there talking. It had his picture in the cover. Yeah. And it said it was done by DJ Screw. And I'm not sure, but I think that was like one of the first records that was had a regular version yeah. and a screwed version. I'm yeah. not I'm not positive, but Yeah, but that was before that people was, were doing that. That was before, that. yeah. This is like nineteen ninety eight, I think, ninety eight, ninety nine. And he was telling us, well, he was telling me that that wasn't even, it, Screw didn't even do. Hold on, hold on, let me tell the story, let me tell the story. Okay, okay, okay. Well, we all know that, you know, DJ Screw was a very, very big connoisseur of, of lean at the time. Now, a lot of people sip lean today, but this is like 1998, like 21 years ago. And um, the whole thing about this album was that, like, we needed to have an album ready for the holidays and I went and, well we went and started getting all of Carlos's features that he was out there getting paid for and we were like grabbing records from everybody and saying, well man, dude, let us put this record out and and we'll promote your, your record label and we'll blow your artists up that are on it and everything. So everybody was like, hell yeah, here you go. And um, so Carlos listened to the record and he was like, man, it sounds good, but I, I don't, it's not, he thought it really wasn't a dope house record you know, but he said, man, it's dope though, let's cut it out. But I think it can be better. And then that's when he had the idea of getting DJ Screw to do a screwed out version of the record. And which I was like, oh, hell yeah, man, cool. So we started calling DJ Screw, calling him up, sending him the records. And dude, it was taking a long time. So I started getting on my cell phone, my next tail. And I was like, hey man, uh, Screw. And he would answer the phone like this, literally, and I was like, huh? And I made the call like three or four times a day, and it was the same thing. And I'm like, man, dude. And so we waited and waited. We had to turn the album in. It's not like today you can just upload it. This is this is before streaming, before download, before iTunes. Everything. We actually had to do CDs and tapes and stuff like that. So. We had to turn the record in, and we only had one day left, so we decided to do the record ourselves and mix it and, and do it ourselves and screw it out, and, and that's what we did. So finally, Screw calls me, hey, what's up, man, da 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 I go, man, dude, I tried to call you. Yeah, man, dude, sorry about that. I'm ready to do the record, but I said, dude, we gotta turn it in tomorrow. And he was like, what? Well, man, I gotta listen to it. So Carlos was like, hey, man, come to Digital Services. So DJ Screw talked on the record, him and Carlos talked on the record, screwed it out, he approved it, boom, we put it out. The actual mix wasn't DJ Screw chopping it up, it was me and DJ Lobo. Now that's just a story from the Dope House Chronicles. <laughs> so we are waiting on the blings to arrive, and when they get here, we will be back. Bart just left, we got our little flash drive situation uh, taken care of, so. We will be right back on track tomorrow's Monday, and we're going to be sending them all out to y'all. Appreciate everybody who took advantage. We had a lot of orders that came through for y'all free flash drives, mm -hmm. and we appreciate all y'all. LucianoTV.com. Setting up. You ready?
I'm ready. I'm ready to eat. I'm hungry. Let's go. <laughs> so, you ready? Yep. Oh my god, the 0 0.5 is super good. No! Uh, Kingston needs a haircut. He has a hair appointment at 5. Shout out to Mike. I just, I just rolled out of bed. And I'm just kind of hungry. Yeah, I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm hungry. Yes, sir! Yeah, I'll put them to work. That's why. <laughs> Last time I went, I went for the Is that French fries? And then he's like, what did you want it? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> it's so zoomed in. I mean, zoomed out. <sighs> like, from this close, it looks like I'm this so good. I'm getting some good shots here, guys. Hold on. Tell them what's going on, Kingston. All right, so we got a whole lemonade right here. Popeyes, yes sir. All the sauces, yes sir. And we got a bunch of chicken sandwiches. This is just the behind the scenes of a mukbang that will be on their channel. So Wait, again, how if y'all want to check it out. Right, so we're finally here sure at the Luciano family house. Say what's up, guys. What's hey, up? Gang, gang. <laughs> we just wrapped up the mukbang with the blings. You already knew. Can I do some burpees? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's recording you. Oh. Talk to them. Yeah, man. We just wrapped up the mukbang. My belly is full. Shout out to Chingo and Molly Sol for coming through. Houston was like, I've know. had enough of this mukbang. Oh, yeah. We got the bean bag. Yes, bean bag alert. Let me test it out. <laughs> my man right here. Oh, my hips hurt. Yeah, what's that? You <laughs> <laughs> Get it lower. Those are dope. It's ergonomically accurate. Oh, uh, really? It goes with my fit a little bit, you know. So during the mukbang, um, Lucky was telling him how they, he does burpees in the morning, as y'all know. And we were about to come up with a little contest. I don't want to outshine the master, so I'm going <laughs> to So Chingo was telling us on the mukbang about uh, your tour, right? Yeah. Yeah, stand-up comedy tour. We, we, uh... 2020, it's called Going Viral 2020. And uh, we're hitting a whole bunch of cities, and including Houston. So we want to have y'all as our guests. Make sure. Uh, hey, hey, so, yeah, so, yeah, hey, yeah. hey. <laughs> See it live. Man, See the we, new stuff. We saw your Netflix show. We I was cracking up. up. <laughs> that's oh, my little beginner. Okay. Dang, that's five, five months postpartum. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah. Yeah, make it a date night. When, when are we doing Houston? September. September. Yeah. My tour manager in the building. Yeah. You know hey, my son. Hey, that's pretty So scary. invite them. <laughs> yeah. To um, if you wanna wanna get tickets to my comedy tour, the Going Viral 2020, chingobling.com. Houston then took over Penny's tablet. Oh, you got it. Get up. You got it. Suite. Yay! Be careful! Thank you! Dile thank you! Dile thank you! Aww! Houston was being mean to her. Okay, dile bye! You're being be mean! Dile bye, vale! Bye! Dile Sprinkle bye. me! No, she don't want to do it. So they are leaping. Peace. Back to the bye. Back to the bye. Bye. Andale. Bye. 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 Game five. Bye. She's bye. like, no, I'm leaving. Bye. Bye. Dile thank you. Thank you. Dile bye bye. All right, guys. Bye. Okay. So pop up. All right. Bye, guys. Bye, you hear Houston. Bye. Oh, yeah? Did that's how you feel? <laughs> hey! <laughs> bye!